In this video, we're going to see how we're going to communicate with third application from Soho Creator. We're going to use the APIs of these web services. And we're going to communicate with those services. And also, we're going to use the function to communicate with the rest of the tools of Soho Creator. First of all, I'm going to go to the application at Soho Creator. And I'm going to create a new application to do all these tests. And create them. Here. Once created the application, the best thing would be to try that the communication that we do against servers outside set outside servers works correctly, generate a communication through a function so we can execute the code and know immediately if we are going to come back with a right code and the communication is done correctly. For this, as you know, we're going to go to Workflow and in Functions we would create a function to make the first test of communication. To do this, we're going to use a web service that through our AP is going to give us a localization, a place, or any that we uh, can use. It's an ID, it's an identification, an AP that identifies inside the net and from where we're connecting from. If we are connecting from a cell phone, from a mobile phone, from an office, it's going to identify through this number, through this AP, and web service is going to give us the service that in which country, what region we are located. This could have multiple functionalities that we can implement and also it's going to give us also, we're going to be able to know from where they're uh, connecting to our, from where they're connecting from and their AP. And also, we could give them from there a different forms, different options in the forms, so they could add, they could get some choices depending on the location that they're at. We could also self-fill information when the form is in one country or another and depending on the person that's connecting we could have self-filled information for that i'm going to use the web service the service web that is called free help dot net dot net when we go directly here that we are connecting from where we're connecting and also it tells us the country, the city, the region. This service, since we are connecting with, with a service, with a company of internet, that could be like, for instance, Telefonica, Yastel, depending on the country, that it could be more or most reliable. But it's difficult that by the AP we can localize the exact place and the exact street. Here we get some information of the version that we have now and further down we're going to use how to use this API. It's a URL which we connect to and indicate some parameter and it comes back with an answer to us. In this case it's going to indicate that this HTTP we need the method get and we can use uh, this to make calls get and post to obtain information of the server for instance